welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Essence of Shea. Let's get right into the video. Let's get into our let's get into our affirmations. Today's affirmation is I am going to make you proud. And that is a note to yourself. Nobody else, nobody else needs to hear this but you. You are going to make yourself, yourself proud. Because that's the foundation of it all, isn't it? Once you make yourself proud, once you do the work that's needed for yourself, <clears throat> everything, everything just comes together. So say it with me. I am going to make you proud. Look yourself in the mirror. Chiquita, bonita, mi corazón. I am going to make you proud. Let's get right into the video was popping was popping was popping with my shake with my shake with my shake shake was popping was popping was popping in this video today i'll be talking about the five different stages of the lock journey see i've had my hair for a very long time and i didn't realize in the beginning that there were stages i just thought that locks were quick fast easy to go i didn't expect them to have so much stuff going on with it and the thing with me is from like a lot of people is that i started my locks off long so because i started my lock locks off long i didn't feel like my hair grew as fast as like say michelle who started her hair off with comb coils or the two strand twist but they were short to me, her hair seemed to grow way longer than mine's, but is because I didn't realize the different stages. So I wanna just sit down real quick and talk to you guys about the different stages. I will try to go through like my subscribers and look for y'all's pictures to post up. Hope you guys don't mind me doing that. I should have asked, but this it's kind of weird to ask close to 10,000 people. Um, it's kind of hard to reach out but hopefully you guys do not mind and if you do please let me know I will gladly take that um, picture down and redo the video but anyways um, phase number one is the starter locks you guys know these these are comb, comb coils these are two strand twist I will only stick with those two because like things like instant lock and free form is just a different ball game we're just talking about traditional locks at the moment so with starter locks these are really shiny they're bouncy they look like a, a fresh newborn baby um you will get frizz in every stage you will get frizz but frizz is not as noticeable in these locks they just look nice they look fresh a lot of people call this the ugly phase because their hair is really short i kind of like that phase i mean because you're never gonna find your hair as shiny and as bouncy as it was in the beginning you're just not phase number two is a pre-lock this is when you've had your locks for a few months and you start seeing more frizz the uh two strand twist uh the strand the separate strands start to mesh together so you don't really see that division anymore same with the comb coils you know the comb coils are like spirals like bouncy spirals you don't really see those anymore because now the lock is starting to form it's starting to do its thing honey the glossy and the smooth look unfortunately are no longer there but this is a good sign because your lock is forming it's coming together it's getting a little, um, not firm, but it's getting more poofy. Almost like the budding stage. Would I consider that the budding stage? Not really, but it's heading to the budding stage. Number three is budding. Frizz, frizz, frizz. Budding galore. Your locks are now saying, look, we have reached a turn. Now it's either we are going to continue on this journey or we will start to comb out. It's, it's almost giving you one last chance 
to decide if this is the route you want to go down. So if this is the route that you want to go down, this is perfect because now your hair is budding, it's looking thick at the ends, the ends are trying to seal, unless you're like me which your ends never seal and that just depends on like your hair texture but the ends start to seal in this um this budding phase a lot of people are nervous about it because the tops are thin and the bottom are thick or like in between uh the locks there are thick parts Th this is a part of it your lock your hair strands are just trying to figure out what it's doing and combining together so I don't want you to freak out when this part is happening this is natural shedding might start to happen as well you're definitely gonna get frizz frizz starts from beginning to the most matured hair so that's one thing you guys have to realize you are going to frizz it's a natural thing it is what it is number four is the most exciting part that's the growth part you've now noticed that sis your hair has reached your shoulder sis you can swing it from side to side sis you can put your hair in a bun sis or them uh, space buns fam that's what you could do now yes your hair has grown now this is where it gets tricky because if you're like me you already at that length but now you notice the shit is going up what is happening well when your hair is short um there's not much hair to be had as far as the shedding goes like the shedding will happen but now whatever excess shed that there is it goes into the lock so it starts to grow now with me my hair was long so once it started to lock there is a lot of shedding that had to be done so the shedding didn't always go into the lock it shed thus caused my hair to look as though it was short but it really wasn't if that makes any sense my length was still there it was just going into a nice tight and coiled coil like a, a nice bouncy house that's just about like it's getting tighter and tighter then once I moisturize it it releases and then you see the length if that I, I feel like I'm make I'm not making any sense let me know in the comment box below. Last but not least is the infamous maturing stage. This is when your hair is matured, sis. This is when you just don't even, I'll show you mine. You just don't even have to worry about nothing no more. You just, just wash your hair. You comb it out. You do what you do. Not comb it out. You wash your hair. You moisturize your hair. You style your hair. You're not too much worried about um, is it locking up, um, am I able to wash it every week now because I don't want my new hair to come out. This is um, the mature stage. So a lot of us are at this stage in the game right now. So a lot of us know that this stage is to me... Um, not one of the easiest stages to have let's keep it a buck because right now is when you actually color your hair more you style your hair more in turn that means you need to take care of it a little bit more you need to watch it more you need to trim it you need to massage you need to do a lot more when it's at the mature stage so a lot of people are in a rush to get it to this but it's easy and not easy at the same time anyways you guys these are the five stages of locks um i wish i had pictures of me but i think that was pretty dope that i could find pictures of my subscribers i got i hope you guys enjoyed this video if i left anything out don't forget to comment in the comment box below also don't forget to like comment and subscribe make sure you turn on your notification bells honey and i will see you guys in the next video see you Later, tiger lilies. Toodles. Uh, crash course. Let me hide the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the curb.